Hello everybody, this is Mad Madness 64 here, and I'm going to be doing a tutorial on how to use VBA Link. People have been having trouble with it, and to be honest, I haven't found a good one on YouTube either, so I'm going to be doing one myself. I have one for the 1.72 and the one for the 1.8. The one I'll be uh, using is the 1.8 because to me it is much more simple than the 1.72. You can use whichever, but I'm not going to be doing anything on the 1.72. Now, what you're going to want to do before anything is make a folder uh, for the Visual Boy Advance because you'll need it. Um, you'll obviously need a ROM. I have Pokemon uh, for this uh, instance. I have Pokemon Emerald. And um, I'll be getting into how to, uh, ma how to make sure the game recognizes both save files for both emulators. And uh, yeah. So first, we'll want to go to this link. I'll put this link in the description. You'll want to click this. Download VBA Link LAN slash Wi Fi Edition. And uh, you'll get a download up here, and it's just a small zip file with a GBA emulator, the VBA. So, anyways, what you'll want to do is open up two of these. Now, I have two of these Visual Boy Advances open. Before you start the emulator, with the games. You'll want to go to the options, go into the emulator, and uncheck, if not already unchecked, pause when in active window. You'll want to do that because both windows need to be active so the game doesn't like crash on you when you're like, let's say, on Pokemon, you're battling or you're trading. Now, you'll want to go into the options, go into link, go into settings one person well both of you if it's two people both of you if you're just using it for yourself um, you'll want to go to network player one will want to go to server player two will want to go to client you'll need to type in your local IP for right now, mine is, well, for me, it's 1.192.168.1.102. Your IP, you can always check by going into, clicking this, if it's Windows 7 or Windows uh, Vista, I believe Vista has it too, and it's a laptop. You'll want to right click, click status, then click details. Your IP will be right here. Your IPv4 address. Now, that's how you get your IP. You'll put it there. Now, before we start the server, we'll want to start the game. So, uh, yeah, that's just the screen. That's just uh, the color scheme being changed temporarily. Uh, recent Pokemon Emerald. Now I have the key map set for both uh the same so yeah it's obviously the same save file one's just has a little more time than the other um here we're in the Pokemon Center you want let's say you want a trade all right options link settings options link settings you go to server click start it'll tell you your local IP so you'll put it in here 192.168.1.102 I made a song now connect one player connected wait for more if it's more than two player for example like Legend of Zelda four swords you can have up to four people you can click yes wait for more but for in this instance there's just two people needed so no all players connected 
You can press cancel, cancel. You may interact directly. Let's trade. Would you like to save the game? Already save file. Don't worry, it's a little laggy on my screen too. As fast as I can. Join group. See? Hey, they're asking for a trade. See, this works on most games that allow wireless adapters. I'm not completely sure on how it works in like Ruby. I mean, there's ways to connect with Ruby, Sapphire, or things that just need the wired cord. Now, obviously, the, tr the trade will be started. As you can see, the that's the same Pokemon I have. Marsh Top, Meryl, Shroomish, and Latad. But that's not what's important. The important thing is that I successfully connected using the... Um, using this, the Visual Boy Advanced Link uh, thing for wireless adapters. Now, just a little heads up, it does not harm your computer, it is completely safe. If it was a virus, I wouldn't be posting this thing on YouTube, saying, oh, it completely works 100%. No. But anyways, yes. that That's it on how to, uh, how to connect through the Visual Boy Advance link. I hope this video was helpful and that's all I am out